couldn't believe it. I thought, oh my. Thanks, Sophia. It was a day almost too good to be true, but a San Diego grandma's wish to see the Padres play in a postseason game became a reality earlier this week thanks to social media and pitcher Blake Snell. I had the chance to talk to the 96-year-old and her granddaughter about this once-in-a-lifetime positively San Diego experience. Watching her Padres pull off a win at Petco Park on the road to the World Series is now something Berta Marill can check off her bucket list. 96-year-old Berta and her granddaughter, Anais Pauly, scored last-minute tickets to Wednesday's electric game thanks to Blake Snell. The energy was just next level. Everyone was so happy. It was really like a spirited game to be at. Anais posted about how her family was having trouble getting wheelchair-accessible tickets to a game on social media, tagging some of their favorite players. And I'm like, come on, guys, you got to do something for my granny. She's a good time. And I tagged them again. The next morning, she woke up to the news they'd been hoping for. Two tickets, courtesy of Snell. A Padres rep said he thought she might be just what they needed. He thinks your grandma's going to be his good luck charm while he pitches on Wednesday. So he has secur secured you guys two tickets to Wednesday's game, wheelchair accessible. And, you know, the rest is history, I guess. Anais says Berta has been a fan of the team since the beginning. Born and raised in National City, she was one of 13 kids born to parents who immigrated from Mexico. She eventually ended up working for the Navy for decades. She is the heart and soul of San Diego. She's the American dream personified. Berta says she had the time of her life. Oh, I couldn't believe it. I thought, oh my Lord, how did this happen? I may, maybe I'll get to go and see them. I was so happy. Making plenty of friends at the stadium with her contagious excitement. Everybody saw I was and they come and give me five. But so many people will be under us and above us and on the way out. And <laughs> Crediting her faith for helping the team get that much needed win. I was glad to be there and when we started losing, it wasn't luck, I was praying. And of course, making sure to thank the guy who made it all possible. Alberta and her granddaughter didn't get a chance to thank Snell in person though and say they are crossing their fingers, hoping they get too soon.